This is Mud Bash, Victoria's largest annual Rover Scout activity, where several hundred rovers gather in the Great Dividing Range for a long weekend of fun-filled competition. A race against the clock is the essence of the Motocana, a rugged course of some 500 metres which tests the durability of the vehicle and the skill of the driver. The course is tightly marked by pegged poles and hay bales, and points are lost if poles are struck by the vehicles. Many vehicles score badly on this event, as they are designed for the more rugged bush events and not for speed and manoeuvrability. Even though crews spend months preparing their vehicles, the stress of competition often results in makeshift repairs. As with all events, crews compete for a maximum of 100 points. The hill climb is no exception with its grueling 1,000 metre incline over varying but steep gradients. Traction means lost points. The object being for the vehicle to climb as far as possible towards the top. Most don't make it. The competition moves on well after dark with a night navigation rally breaking the crisp winter air. Each crew is issued with a detailed map of the area, requiring them to navigate over a set course incorporating 12 checkpoint controls. Once again, vehicles are extensively scrutineered to maintain a high standard of safety, with the emphasis being on efficient lighting, brakes and steering. Covering a challenging 20 kilometres of rugged bush tracks in an average of three hours proves to be the most popular of all events.
Not only do the crews encounter the usual problems with the rough conditions, but they have to navigate over progressively tougher sections of the course and complete as many of the checkpoints as possible. Points are lost if a checkpoint is entered from the wrong direction or in an incorrect sequence. The main campsite is set up with many facilities, ranging from power supply, hot showers, canteen, St John's ambulance and an extensive communications network. The obstacle course provides an opportunity for competing crews to pit their vehicles against a combination of deep water crossings, muddy bogs, hairpin bends and extensive ruts and depressions. As with all events, Points are lost if any crew member assists the vehicle by pushing. The water crossings take their toll in stalled vehicles. However, a four-wheel drive is usually on hand to tow the vehicle clear. since its inception. From a dozen entries in the early 70s, this annual event now attracts more than 40 vehicles and several hundred spectators over its three-day duration. 